jab by Larry Holmes. Fifth is trying to do. Holmes trying to go inside knock. That was a very good right hand by Larry Holmes, the champion. Holmes is up on his toes. I don't like when he's just keeping that left hand down. He's bringing, he's throwing, he's bringing it down. This guy, this guy has good punching power. And once again, Holmes. Ray, who do you feel in favors? Well, quite naturally, Larry Holmes. It's in his best interest. A little blood now underneath the eye, up on the cheek. He's going to give angle, step side to side. He's not throwing more combinations. Got that right hand in and the left hand down. Jeff. He's going to the body. He's going back into the head. Uh, one, two punches. And Holmes getting the better of that exchange. And now there's blood above the left eye of Smith. And he's not going to have too far to go. And Smith just taking all sorts of punishment on the left. Larry now basically is picking his shot. Jabs. And the eye is pretty nasty, although there's not any blood getting into the eye right now with Smith. There's a right hand by Smith. And there was another overhead right. That buckled the knees of Smith. That was a great shot by Holmes. Best punch of the fight. You and Nelson will... Smith trying to really brawl it. The eye, incidentally, is not really... And once more, a combination by Holmes. There was a good right hand that hurt Smith. Perfectly executed right hand. You can look about it from you can look at it from above. Block, go ahead and throw it. That's something I would think is easier said than done. Well, again, what Smith is doing, he's starting to push his jam. And he is keeping him in the center of the ring. He's fought his fight. That was a fairly good right hand that did get in by Smith. And there was another right hand. 30 seconds left in the round. There was a right hand by Holmes. The only question, of course, about Larry Holmes is his age. At some point, he's going to go. But when is it? There's another right hand by Smith. And another right hand by Smith. Best round of the fight by far for both pressure Smith. Well, see, Smith now is starting to rush that. Let's see if we can get a look at Bone Crusher Smith. There you see him. Big punch. Well, now you have to start thinking about conditioning a little bit here. Words of encouragement from Larry Holmes' corner. You know what happens, Larry, when the fight gets, the fight gets older. Another right hand by Smith. Good shot by home by uh, Smith a bit here, too. Well, after such a long time he fought, which has been almost a year, he went only one round against Marvis Fraser. And five rounds, two months, but Emil Griffin had said in Smith's corner, he said, when he throws a punch, you throw a punch. And he took a shot, did Holmes. He gave one to the midsection, but he took one in return. Smith's timing is punches a lot better. When they, uh, Griffin told uh, Smith that Holmes was tough. Smith's out of the body. He hasn't done that. But Lars really basically trying to pick his shots. Dale's right hand. And Holmes is cut over the eye. He says it was a butt, and I believe it was. This is going to test the champion now. And he is angry. Clip Larry Holmes.
but you don't want to disappoint your wife and kids, your team. Smith took a good shot from Holmes. Both these men are going to know they've been in a fight, I'll tell you that. There's going to be some aches and pains tomorrow. Oh, for sure, that's a given. Because he had a lot of heads. The fact is, that is fights for the title. That's the biggest obstacle, the psychological obstacle. And he's definitely overcome, he's overcome that. When Smith throws his left hook, it doesn't, it doesn't look That was a good right hand by Holmes. It's, it's very deceptive. A lot of power behind him. And a good left hook. Two good punches by Holmes, and now the blood continues to pour from Bone Crusher Smith. And how does it work? And a good right hand by Holmes, and that slowed Smith up.